Uh, my name is Silvia Carolina Rivera. I am from Lima, Peru, and I have been the island already one year and a half. It's not that hard as it as it sounds. It's um, at the beginning you uh, you are like struggling with uh, leaving your original place where you arrive or your country, but when the time goes, you start to see that you live in a very good island with a lot of tourists, very popular, and the level of food and beverage, it's very good, it's very high. There's a lot of chefs that are trying to get the position then, and they see that it's very hard. But here you can um, build your career, you can keep going and going. I know chefs that came from Kumis or Apprentice and now they chef the parties and in, in, even a junior soup. So that's a good thing. It's a level that is really, really good for yourself and your career to go level by level, little by little. It's, it's, not, it's, it's not going to make you less. If you want to change, for example, from, I mean banquet trying and uh, banqueting, weddings, if I want to do seafood, I can go to mariners. I know everybody there. If I want to do fine dining uh, yes, courses, I can go to Bumi. I know everybody there. Or uh, Asian high step, bokachu, very intense food, very good food. I mean, you can, it's like you are not quitting your job from one to another. You are just uh, trespassing from outlets. You want to do hotels, room service, a la carte, you can go to the review or Qualia or many, many outlets. Um, if you're thinking that it's a bad thing to live in the city where you live in or coming so far away from the big cities in Australia, it's not bad. You are far away but the level of for your career it will be awesome it helped me a lot my background in sydney helped me a lot and here it's, you make a lot of relationships you make a lot of uh, experience it's a positive thing uh, food and beverage all the tourism here is high class in anywhere you go so it's it's very good for for a start or continue your career